Hey, welcome back to Skies of Arcadia Legends, where we have a very impatient vice. We are just about to go head up the boss of this area, it would seem. So now's a good time to make sure all our affairs are in order. Whoop, wrong button. Wrong button. I'm good like that. I should have enough crystals to go around. Everyone's got full magic, everyone's got full health. Alright. Up we go. Up the colossal set of stairs. That's a big ass bird. Nice advice to show a uh, appropriate reaction. Alright, so I'm going to have a fairly boring start to this. Everybody guard. Let's see what's what. This seems like a good idea for something to cast. Circle of Panic. Don't remember much about this boss fight. Oh, great, Drachma's confused. Oh, and he has to go and crit, doesn't he? Okay. It's time for Cutlass Fury. Curia crystal. And guard for me. Hey. Okay, well, it doesn't look like this is going to be too difficult, a boss. Oh, what? That is mean. Now we need to cast um, Increm on Vice again. That's cheeky. That is cheeky. Yeah, that should have done twice the damage. Here we go again. Moons, give me strength. I don't. Oh, what? Let's try this. Maybe I could use a sacred crystal on him. Not a sake crystal, a curio crystal. Well, there's definitely a big heal coming his way soon. That is just so annoying. I did not mean to use a Curia Crystal on him. Let's I meant to this. use it on Dracula. But at least I know that Curia will strengthen him. Okay. Dracula's 
not really need much aside from a heal. What's the affiliation of this guy? It's green. So let's got a Perez box right there. Let's try Perez box. Uh, gotten the increment boost quicker, but never mind. Let's try this. Unless this guy hasn't shown us a certain move, he's not really a very difficult boss. Oh, there it is. <laughs> well, that's a good thing we got um, Cutlass Fury off straight away, isn't it? Move. Give me strength! She's going to cast Anchor on Vice while he's asleep. Well, we're getting there. We're getting there slowly but surely. stock up on a lot of items <laughs> next time I come around. I can't remember who I set Aika to heal. Ica, heal, Vice, Fina, heal, Drachma, Drachma, you guard for now. Let's try this. Oh, really? Oh, okay. Casting it on Fina is not too bad. Because that's all the damage she's going to do. Oh, nice. One more of those. Oh, look at that. You can see Cupel. Spins around when she's confused. Ah! I'm getting my... I'm getting lost and confused. Nice guard. Ooh, almost did him in. <laughs> Let's try this. Huh. 
Oh, Fina, stop it. Come on. I'll let this one play out because the last one of the fight. Boom. That's how we do. And it has to explode, of course. Hang the moon's nothing. We rocked that fight. She would quit ya. Yeah, we heard you the first time. So Grendel wasn't destroyed by the range of destruction. Sounds a little out of sync in that cutscene. It's not the caretaker at all! Or it's not a ghost at all, it's the caretaker! that up. Someone done goofed. And Drachma has his usual answer. I'm gonna break your head. They plan to unleash the green giant, Grendel. They wanted us out of the way. They knew what would come.
There is a way. Let us handle this. We're pretty good at this sort of stuff. We're going to get even better later on, trust me. We get some really epic stuff later. Uh oh, SpaghettiOs! If you can hear my controller rumbling, they're going crazy. Great! I never played this game with vibration before. I'm loving this. It's still vibrating like mad. Hello again, Alfonso. He's nothing if not a pride man. Head for the light! Head for the light, Alfonso. Yeah, you might not want to head for that light. Ready for sweet corn. Ho ho ho, green giant. <laughs> I don't think anyone's ever punched a ship before and taken it out. That's fantastic. I love it. You go, Grendel. Controller's still going crazy here. Now what will you do, Alfonso? What do you do here? Do you stand and fight? Of course he doesn't. Well, I suppose at least Isapa achieved one of his goals. The balloons are gone. <laughs> now, there's plucky, and then there's just absolutely ridiculous. And the idea that we can stop this in the little jack, a wooden fishing vessel when the entire armada failed. Well, the entire armada. The ship of the armada failed. <laughs> it's ridiculous. You know what I'm reminded of when I saw that foot thing? If anyone's ever watched Thunderbirds, the original puppet show with the um, the big logging thing that fell over and got stuck. Oh look, it's the logo and the chameleon again. on the ship, that would surely kill them. If it's as destructive as it seems, that would surely kill everyone on who's on the deck of that ship. Well, 
don't seem to be that destructive. The ship's still, still in the air. <laughs> that kind of backfired, didn't it, Deluca? It's still awake. It's still doing things. something up? It's twitching. Is it picking up a chunk of earth? Yes! Oh, no. It just smacked a floating island. It appears to have a headache. to Luku first. Because things aren't going to be difficult enough. I don't know if the, um, the flipping thing is because I have to hit him a certain way or because I have to make a tactical decision. I mean, this fight should be a no-brainer, shouldn't it? We shouldn't stand a chance. Ouch. I think the game plays its hand a little too quickly with the ship battles. Obviously, you don't want to get anything boring starting off, otherwise people can get into it. But at the same time, you do need to um, keep things real and balanced a bit. I'm starting you off fighting the Armada. <coughs> Just seems a bit much, really. Damn, that's doing a lot of damage. I don't think he has the flamethrower anymore. Great. So that chance ride was absolutely useless. It was actually a chance ride. Okay, we need to heal next time, right? safe and back off. We don't get any chances. We also don't have to face the Moonstone Cannon. If we take our chances, we'll get the chance rounds to do extra damage. We'll have to face the Moonstone Cannon. I want to play it safe and back off. Because we need to heal. Touching that thing. 
need to get into a position to use the Moonstone Cannon. Also, can't knock my ship off balance if I'm not moving. That's not really how it works, Deloco. You're in the air. Trust me, I can knock you off balance. Pew! Light torpedoes! just using really bad cannons? I don't think I am. We take a base of action. Well, at least the torpedo is doing something. We lost the cannon, but... We're right in the path. Fantastic. How much does it do? 2,000. Okay. So we can heal this easily enough. Now this is our chance to go out, do some damage, and we'll make our tactical decisions next time on Skies of Arcadia Legends. We'll see you then.